Hi guys, welcome for another video for you again today. Today's video is another reveal video of this small Chanel handbag that I bought back in Hong Kong again. <laughs> yes, guys. So before I leave Hong Kong, I, you know, actually this one is not planned. Um, one day I was just walking past um, Milan Station. Uh, that is the second hand store back in Hong Kong and I passed by I just said I just want to browse and have a look I don't really intend to buy but then I found this item and uh, yeah without further ado let me reveal to you what I got so it comes with this bag that is already broken but I think I can easily glue it later oops you can see it <laughs> so yeah here it is so i have my authenticity card right here it's from um 15 series as you can see uh the authenticity card is already the number already fading but i can still clearly see the numbers there although it's like half fading already and then this is my receipt it's from uh yeah milan station and also comes with this care card so for the vintage bags i saw a lot of them have this kind of care card in, an, in this very cute uh like a beige envelope beige envelope looks like so and so yes this is my um, Chanel Half Moon Walk uh, in beige color, in very, very shiny gold hardware, you guys, look at that, so beautiful, and um, when I first saw this uh, from other people wearing this uh, Chanel walk, I I don't really feel attracted to it. You know, I still prefer the Chanel classic uh, wallet on chain. That's why um, you know I bought I bought it twice. Um, the first classic Chanel wallet on chain that I got is in black uh, caviar leather in gold hardware, which is a very, very beautiful combination. Very, very classic. But then uh, it did not work out for me and uh, I sold it, which is I did not lost any money. I just um, sold it from what I bought it for. And then the second time again i tried to uh, buy another classic walk and uh, that is my pink iridescent pink caviar leather which is very very um very popular combination uh very very nice pink and um yeah i just didn't really use it i love it i love the combination i love the color but it's just that uh, something in a wallet on chain that uh, I felt like still like I'm struggling to put my things uh, in there even though I don't really carry much. As, as you know, I really love small bags so I shouldn't get used to it, you know, to, to be so minimal. But then I don't know why I, that's, that's, I don't know why that the wallet on chain doesn't work for me so um i said i sold that again and uh, i did not make money or i did not make any profit for that but at least uh, i did not lose any also so i just break even and so that's it i thought that's it for that's it for me for wallet on chain so but then <laughs> 
Uh, as I told you, I just walk. I'm just walking past, and uh, you know, I, I I just passed by to Milan Station, and then I saw this one, and uh, I tried it on, and I saw the color. I said I don't have. Um, I used to have the classic flap in this color in beige, and uh, I sold it as well which is i i regret now <laughs> and then i kind of miss that and this in i never saw this um half moon walk even though in a pre-lab market in this uh color combination i mostly see them in either in burgundy or in black so when i saw it in this beige color i'm like oh my god you know and it's really really nice and um you know i just fell in love and when i asked for how much they are selling for at the time it's also like really affordable i for a wallet on chain and so yes guys so that's why i got it <laughs> and uh yeah so let me just um show you the the feature of this um, half moon walk so it has this uh, CC logo stitched on the leather looks like so and then it comes with the magnetic uh, closure like that which is very very convenient and then uh, there's a Chanel there stamp and also the button here is also says uh, Chanel I don't know if you can see so yeah uh, a lot of scratches there already from you know uh, signs of usage and uh, as I said this is from 15 series and the uh, the hologram sticker is right here looks like so and inside looks like so it has uh, six altogether six uh, card slots in there and it comes with this uh, fabric lining as i think it's very uh common for uh wallet on chain from chanel and as you can see there's some dirt marks there ready so it doesn't and also here are the you know the mark of usage on both corners but i don't really mind that i think it's just you know common wear but aside from you know some some dirt marks there inside is actually really uh, not bad condition doesn't really have much uh, it's not really that, it's not dirty or a lot of uh, it doesn't come really in uh, you know I mean it's still in a very pretty condition and this is a made in italy which is uh, comes in this uh, extra leather uh, slip packet right here and then there's a leather zipper pull here another packet quite smooth looks like so and then another slip packet here also clean and yeah at the back look like so it doesn't have any uh, back packet like the um, classic Chanel walk uh, that's the downside of it it could have been nice if we have uh, packet there as well but yeah it is what it is when i bought it also have some uh, color transfer here but i already tried to uh, clean it with the leather conditioner and 
yeah i done pretty good it's quite easy to remove because you know i think because it's a caviar leather and then here at the bottom it has this uh quilted uh chanel you know classic uh design and as you can see on here at the first slip packet here uh it has like a plated stitch which is uh you know give it a little bit more uh you know unique look into it i believe and i think this is also a very common uh science of usage of this uh wallet on chain is this on the side here it's like folded but that doesn't bother me so this is like really like a dumpling bag <laughs> so um i also gonna show you how it looks like on me so this is how it looks like on me crossbody so it sits this is my hip and it sits right here yeah um like all the wallet on chain looks like this it comes like this i mean in a very long <laughs> chain so i get to shorten it and it looks like so on my shoulder i also like it on me like this and then inside I will tuck in the chain and I can use it as a clutch it's also very very nice so So, uh, yes, guys, if you are a um, Chanel fan and you really, really want to get a uh, wallet on chain, and um, as you know, guys, um, the Chanel always keep on, you know, having their price in increase and even the wallet on chain, um, is really really high now so um i suggest that uh you know if you just want to have something to um start with in chanel i suggest for you to uh get one of these uh this is already um discontinued i think uh, they stopped producing this uh 2013 and mine one i believe it's a 15 series so i believe it's from this bag is from 2011 and look at that guys 10 years and still looking really good you know and because of this caviar leather you know it's really really durable i believe and um yeah um i want to show you what can fit um i'm using this uh palm spring at the moment and uh, i also believe because i already had uh, the wallet the classic wallet on chain before so i know what can fit there and I believe that this one can really fit more than the classic wallet on chain. Um, I have the mask here. <laughs> so I have my card uh, holder. My, oops. Yeah, so this is real. I did not. <laughs> my mini pochette uh, comes with some mouth spray, some plastic lipstick yeah all that 
good stuff. <laughs> and my um, compact um, foundation from Chanel. And also my Bastia, which is not my coin purse now because here in Vietnam, they don't really use coins. I never see one yet <laughs> and so I use it as my wallet and uh, their money just fits right fits right there when uh, single folded so yeah this is really really good and I have my tissue and that's all inside my uh, my palm spring mini and so let's try to fit it all in here. Let's try to see whether it fits the mini pochette. And my mini pochette don't really, uh, I didn't really put much things in it. But yes, it can fit. But it's pretty much um occupy the space already but yes i can close it no problem and the look is still nice let's see whether i think i can still fit in my bastia looks like so and let's try to fit in my very thick uh compact foundation we'll see i never tried this before so it's looking like so and my tissue now looks like so my card maybe it's gonna be a bit tight but yeah i still put it there now let's try no <laughs> so one close um let's try to take it out and i think what will i do is that i'll just put the cards that are uh, important or yeah it has six card slots so uh, i'm gonna try to put one or two but yeah, if you want to fill up all the card slots there, I think also it can do. But yeah, so I just put two there for just for you to show you. But yeah, if you want to fill all the card slots there, I think it's also possible. And we'll see whether it can close. Still, yeah. I have to push it a little bit down to close it and it looks like this on top but then I think it's still doable like so because the style of this handbag it's already like you know crumpled anyway it's like it already has that look so even though you try to uh, uh you know stuff it in full capacity i i don't think it affects that look much because you know uh, yeah still nice so wow yes guys look at that so looks like so on my uh, shoulder but i won't do this uh, I won't carry it this way because it's really, really long so I will show you once again I will crisscross like that and yeah I a little bit struggle to close but still you can and yeah this will do me carry it like so and when I try to uh, carry it in double chain, let me see, let me show you. There you go. 
so I can carry it like that also my hands walking like so and the crook of my arms shoulder carry like so like that guys it's really really nice i'm really really loving this so i can highly highly recommend this and um i know that uh, i can already see myself carrying this more often you know compared to uh, my wallet on chain my classic wallet on chain before and uh, I can tell that this is a keeper <laughs> because you see uh, the things that I, I carry here in my um, palm spring also can fit here so you know the fact that I can fit my mini pochette in there is you know wow it's already a game changer you know I for my normal uh for the classic wallet on chain that i have before if i fit or i put the mini pochette there i think that's it i can carry but for me for this uh half moon walk look at that it's wow it's really fit a lot guys yeah so this is really good for travel for yeah i it's gonna be very very versatile you guys so if ever you can find this in the pre-love market i bought this for eight thousand uh, hong kong dollars so i bought it for eight thousand hong kong dollars and i believe that's equivalent to one thousand us uh, dollars and um yeah i really really believe that for a chanel um bag very very versatile like this it's already worth the price i believe and uh, you know especially now um the small bags is very very in at the moment and uh yeah so i think this is gonna be a really really good um piece to have if you are starting uh your chanel journey so yeah that's it you guys i hope you like this video and i hope this is going to be helpful to you if you are eyeing one of this uh, kind of handbag chanel half moon walk and so um, i hope you get uh, your hands in one so yes guys thank you so much for watching bye